Civil servants in Adama State have commended Governor Ahmadu Murufindri for swiftly implementing the new 70,000 Naira national minimum wage. Adama is reportedly the first state to roll out the new wage aimed at alleviating the economic challenges facing Nigerians. Gibson so Adigo reports from Yola. The extra amount in the August salary of Adama State civil servants came as a pleasant surprise sparking widespread joy. This boost reflects Governor Ahmed Murfintry's commitment to fulfilling the promise of the 70,000 minimum wage in line with the federal government's directive. The governor affirmed his readiness to uphold the law, stating he will not contest what is now a legal obligation. So we felt there is nothing that is too much for you. We felt even if the government would plead, we have to satisfy our workers. And by the way, it is not our choice. It has become a law. So why do I need to delay a day to implement what has become a law? Why do I need to drag with my workers? Why is it that it is only when it affects the workers, when it affects the common man, that government usually drags? Civil servants in Adama State are lauding Governor Ahmed Murfintry for taking the bold step to implement the national minimum wage. They highlighted that Adamawa is not only excelling in infrastructure development, but also prioritizing human capital development under the PDP-led government. What his colleagues in some other states are shying away from uh, uh, the obligation to more especially workers. Uh, here in Adama State, it has also been, it has always been uh, a, a good one for us. It was a big amount that every worker should appreciate because uh, it's motivating, it's encouraging, and the fact that uh, it is coming at this crucial time, that makes it even more, you know, appreciative because it will go a long way in addressing some of the challenges we are facing. Civil servants who are working with the post primary school management board received uh, the highest share due to uh, the way the new minimum wage is being structured in Alabama State. As it is right now, many people are counting on me. And with this money, I can do a lot with it. The Adama State government plans to submit a request to the State Assembly to amend the law governing the salaries of Judiciary, Accountant General's Office, and State Assembly workers. This adjustment aims to ensure that these employees also benefit from the 70,000 minimum wage by September. Gibson Soadgo, Trust TV News, Yola.